Hey guys! So, this is my first Shop Miss A haul, and I'm really excited because I got a bunch of stuff. So, let me show ya. Like, legit a box full. Oh god. Let me get you that 360 view. Oh god. Anyway, you get my point. Um, but yeah, so, um, I have a bunch of goodies, and I will be showing you all of them. So I'm going to start from like kind of like head to toe, like everything that I bought. So let's get started. Okay, so the first thing um, is uh, eye, eyebrow mascara and it's from Clean Color. Let me take off the little thing. Okay, so it's from Clean Color brow mascara and um... It expires in six months. I always check the back, like literally, like when it expires, and just so I know, kind of like keep track of it, you know. And let's open it up. Okay, so it's like really gooey, and obviously it looks like a mascara, and it's brown. Um, I just don't know if it's like the right color for my eyebrows. So let's see. I think so. Like, I can make it work we'll see um I got these eyebrow or the eyebrow mascara because um I usually use elf's um clear mascara or like yeah like clear mascara it could be for like brows or your own mascara like whatever and well it's usually clear but this like bunch of like gunk and like powder and like yeah just gross and um they were a dollar and you know elf is like a pretty cheap brand and a really good brand as well but online the prices started getting up and this is now two dollars so i was like bruh like are you serious like they were always a dollar until now you bumped it up another dollar i was like i was like elf need to cut it soon okay but so i was just like whatever so i'll just like stock myself up with you know whatever shop miss a had and they had clear ones but they were sold out so and that and that's how it sells out sells sells out really fast so yeah all right so next thing i got was eyeshadow primer and it's in matte yeah and this one expires in 18 months so yeah let me swatch it for you Actually, it's just like a, uh, it's like, it's just like a really clear, you just blend it in like that, it just disappears, you know, it feels really good, it smells like, like baby powder? Oh no! like leaking you know I dropped it <gasps> no well that's not good all right how about it are you for real though I just bought it <sighs> it's a dollar but I was really excited to Let's try to seal it up with some tape. Alright. Quick tapey. Oh man, there's a dollar with sale, you know. I waited two weeks for this package, so it ain't going to go to waste. Dang. I'm going to go to the tape. Alright, I'm going to get some soaps. I'm sorry, dude. This is like a fucking surgery right now, but I'm still operating. I can't fix my guy from holes or whatever. Well, I was like, how to fix that. I swear you're so lonely. Mm -hmm. Is the one up? And there you go. Nothing you can't fix. Nothing you can't fix. Okay. I'm ready now. So I the eyeshadow primer. Um I got a lot of stuff on everything. Okay, so the little nose. Oh. Okay. Hold up. Okay, so the next thing is the next thing is um um eyeliner, and this is from Amuse Long Lasting. 
missing eyeliner. What a poof. Eh, what a poof. What a proof. And uh, this looks like this. sent me the wrong eyeshadow. Always, always look at your seat because, you know, you just want to know. Like, you know, if you got everything right. And I wanted a single eyeshadow from, I think it's a, the same company, Amuse, as the eyeliner. And this is in Deep Dust, but I got it on mine was Plum Dreams or something like that. Let me find the receipt. Like, Plum something. And they didn't send me that, so I was like, really, really mad. Oh yeah, Plum Dreams. I'll show ya right there. Plum dreams. Right there. Plum dreams. And then I was like kinda mad because they sent me the wrong one. And then they're like so I looked up like how to like you know do returns and like exchanges or whatever. You have to return like the whole package back. And I was like, bruh. No. Like and just for like, you know, a dollar item, like whatever, like I wasn't freaking out or whatever, but still, you know, it's like ridiculous. So I was just like, whatever. So I guess I'll just order it again, but hopefully that they send me the right one. But this one is from Amuse, and it's Deep Dust, and I looked it up, like, online, like, what color it was or whatever. And it's, like, a, um, like a brown, like a dark brown, I think. Yeah. So I'll swatch it for you, and I'll let you know what, it, what color it looks like. And I think it's matte, so I'm not really sure, though. But let me try to open it. It's not letting me open. Dude, seriously? Okay. I mean, yeah, it's like a dark brown, I think. Well, that's what it looks like, and I'll swatch it for you. Hmm, really pigmented. It's not chalky or anything. Oh, just gotta grab up in there. So it's not chalky or anything like that. So it's pretty good. And yeah. Um. Uh, so, I mean, like, I have a bunch of browns, like, what you, I'm not too excited about it, so whatever. So, the next thing is, um, eyeliner still, oh, I got this one, this is, like, really pretty, and I think it's called, like, Pixie Jar or something. Yeah, Pixie Jar, from Clean Color as well, and, oh, this is cool, so it comes with, like, a, it's a black eyeliner, it comes with, like, a little pencil one, or not pencil, but just, like, you know what I mean, and... My mouth's cool. And then you open this up. Oh. Hold on. I guess you connect it together. What the heck? Oh. And it comes with this little one. And. Voila. Oh, this one's a lot thicker than the other one. Which, I don't know how I feel about it. But, I don't know. They look like they're kind of the same. But we'll see. So, yeah. This is really cute. I like the packaging. It's pink. I love pink. So, we'll see. And, yeah. But it's really cute, though. So, and it has, like, a little, um, like, a little diamond on top right there. It's, like, really cute. Matches my nails. Okay, the next thing I got was, um, mascaras. And this is from Clean Color as well. And it's the same kind of, like, like, um, packaging as the eyebrows. And it's frame framus or something like that. So I'm gonna show you the difference. And yeah, but I like I picked these up because this one has a al aloe vera in it, and this one has avocado seed oil in it. So I definitely try these out. I'm not gonna really open them right now because I already have a bunch of mascaras open, and I don't wanna open it. And this lasts six months. Like I feel like the really really good high end products last a lot longer than you know the cheaper ones or whatever but you know they're still good i mean you just have to like you make a use out of them so oh before i get into lips um i got blushes all right well, i'm gonna tell you i went a little crazy on the blushes so i got eight blushes like from the same like brand or whatever and they usually have 12 of them but i got eight so well, let me buff it out um oops 
so yeah i'm like throwing everything everywhere so i got eight of them and i didn't get the other four only because they look similar to like all these other eight so and when i swatch them and when i show you they may look like they're alike but literally they're not like they have they may look alike but one's a little darker one's a little lighter but the other four that i felt like they all look alike like two of those ones except one of them they were like a darker like a plummy color but um yeah so the, it's called from miss cheek chick i don't know and um they're small cute compact and i got eight of them and i did go a little crazy but the only thing is like when i got them i was like oh i expected them to be bigger you know but because they advertise it bigger on, online but i was like you know what no i got eight of them like i don't feel bad if i threw them away in Ooh, 24 months so it's like two years if I threw them away because they're small you know like it's a dollar like you know whatever like but if I were to buy like eight eyeshadows from from freaking um like Too Faced not eyeshadows like blushes from Too Faced or like NARS or whatever like I'd feel bad because of like oh I wasted all my money on that you know but this is just like eight of them they're small they're cute for traveling like and you know it's just compact and yeah and like you could and you could have a bunch of them and it'll last you a while so so let me just get straight to swatching so I'm gonna do like from the lightest or like pinky to the more coral so this one's gonna be um petal this one's really cute really? like I said I like the packaging it's really cute compact and it's just adorable so let me swatch it for ya ooh they're really pigmented and soft that's petal like I said, bear with me with the swatching because, you know, it takes a while. You know what I mean? Alright, so this one is in Rosa. That's a pretty rose. Oh, the yellow. So, it's going to be Rose. Cute. This one is in Sunset. This one's so cute, too. Like, I'm telling you, they're all freaking adorable and so cute. Like I said, they may look alike, but they're not, okay? Let's see? It's Sunset. This one is in Guava. I think, like, one of my favorites. And now... Guava. And they may look alike, but you could tell like they're kind of different. So let's go guava. This one is tangerine. It's like a bright, like a oh, bright. It's like pop. You know what I'm saying? Pops. Um. Let me swatch that again. Okay, tangerine. So y'all. Yeah. Um, let me just clean it off. Okay, tangerine. Alright, here comes like the more like ugh, darker ones. Like, see, they look like kind of look alike, but they're not. So, this one is. Coral. Meep. So, much light for you. Oh, it's gonna come on, right? Because I have the makeup remover. Sounds um, coral. So you can tell. Like I said, I'll do like a try to do like a full face with like all these products on, and I'll let you know. Well, you know when that happens. Come on, man. It's because you know um, the makeup remover, so kind of like won't pick up. So that one's coral, and this one is. Oh, I didn't even tell you what name this is. It's just sunbaked really pretty like this will go good with the vampy look but um this is sun baked and uh yeah it doesn't really look like coral like a tell. there's more orangey there's more red like i'm telling you like they all look different i mean they may look alike but they're not so yeah so those are those so i'm gonna wipe them off i'm gonna let me look one more time and i think this was like petal rose sunset petal rose sunset Sunset. Oh, Petal Rose, Sunset Guava, Tangerine, Coral, and Sunbaked.
Okay, I'll put the link down below in order. And I'm going to erase that. And I'm going to show you um, these, like, highlighters that I got for my face. Um, I'm going to tell you, I'm disappointed. But it's a dollar, so I ain't going to complain. Well, let me tell you. Okay, so this one is like a, like a highlight. It has, like, gold shimmer in it white and a little bit of pink yeah if you can see anything else and um i'm gonna try to swatch it because they're really hard with these little balls <laughs> balls and uh yeah so this is a warp stamp for you so this one's pretty good i mean i'm not complaining that much you know but it's kind of chalk it's on the chalky side for sure and i'm gonna show you this one I don't know if I really like this one or if I'm going to try it yet, but this one is like a purpley pink, and this one came with less balls. Okay, oh here, I'm going to show you. Less balls. Oh no, what fell? It's like a pink and purples. I use it as a highlight. I don't totally, it's like really hard to, like I don't know. I mean you can, I mean like, it's pretty, I just, I'm not used to it, you know? But if I am going to use it, I'm going to have to, like, crush the ball and, like, get the pigment. But these balls like this, see, like, you can barely tell. So, so that's the light one and that's one the purple. Okay. So, I don't know. I, I, would I repurchase these? No. Alright, so after the fight. Um, let me, let's get into those lip, lip products. Um, okay, so I got a bunch of lipsticks, but I didn't get like the whole thing, you know what I mean? Like, I just got different colors that I like, like I didn't get all of them, like, cause I didn't want to. But they're all from, um, some of them from Santine, some of them from Clean Color, so I'm just going to separate them. And, yeah. So let's do the Clean Color first, I guess. So, oh, I hate, I don't like, it took a while. My trusty scissors. Madly Matte Lip Gloss. Madly Matte. And when you see like all the colors that I got, like, they're all like dark purple. And I only wear dark purple like during the winter and during like autumn season. So I like, I mean, I wear it like every single day. Like I wore some today and it was from, I'm just getting ahead of myself. I'm gonna do clean color real quick. So let's just do the swatches and whatever. So, um, yeah. Oh crap. And this color is in... Ugh. This color is in, um, so the last two years, dang it, I don't know what the color is in, sorry guys. Darn it. Rose wine. Took me a while. Um, so it's in rose wine. Oop. Nice. Nice. So let's do a swatch. It's kind of droopy to be honest. Hopefully, I don't want to look the same, but that's what it looks like. Giving me a headache. Okay, another clean color one. And it's like a dark purple. My trusty scissors again. Okay, guys. Can't open wrappers for my laugh. Okay. So, see if it has the same smell. Oh, God. It doesn't smell bad, but it just has a fruity smell that kind of makes my head hurt. Like, I don't know. Like, I'm that kind of person who, like, 
has a citrusy, citrusy, citrus. If I'm like next to citrus smells, like my head hurts. So it's just probably me. So obviously you tell it's different. This one has more pigment than the other ones. Like that one's like really sheen. Like not like just it won't, doesn't have take out too much product. Okay, so now on to the next one. Oh my god, I didn't even tell you what that color that was. I'm so bad. What color was black? Yeah, the color was black. Well, that's weird. Or was it though? Oh, black cherry. Black cherry. Black cherry. Okay. I'm bad. I'm going to tell you the names now because, you know. I don't know if this has a name or not. So this is from Santee. And uh, this doesn't have a name, but it's a number two. And it's just matte liquid lipstick. And, um... Anyways, let me tell you the story. So I have a darker one that I'll show you in a little bit. It's a darker one and I opened it and I was like, well, you know, I want to test it out. So when I do review it, I actually could tell you right then and there. So I tested it out, I wore it today and um, put my, lap, my lips are checked. But I wore it today and I was like, all right, whatever. Looks good, dried pretty fast. Like if you leave for like two or three minutes, so it'll dry completely. And I have a boyfriend in it. Um, but I like him kiss and so when I kissed him and like got on him like this a little bit, then he was, he always gets mad. Like he's just like really big, like it looks like I have lipstick on, but like just wipe it off. And then so he did whatever, so the whole day we went out to eat, came off a little bit, and then I drank uh, drank my drink, came off, and at the end of the day when I got home, I did not notice. I look like a chola. Like you know my lips are chat, like it's just gross. I'm just showing you what it looks like. Like after like it wears off. And my lips are chat, I look like a chola, like just having like a eyeliner filled out and nothing in the middle. And yeah, it was just you no, know, it's just like okay. So like I don't know, like it's good like if you're gonna be in class all day and you're not eating or drinking anything, so I mean if that's what you want, then cool. But I mean, you know, I'll just wear it off to side again, maybe I'll just rub it off a little bit to show or something. So but anyway, on to the next. So this one's a number two in matte liquid lipstick. <laughs> Santine. I can't even open it right now, so hold on. Oh man. This is so annoying. Okay, here we go. Oh god, this is a bright pink. I'm not into bright pinks. We'll see. Online it looked different, you know? It just looks so much different. It's the I mean, it's pigmented and everything, like, you know, but it's just like, I don't know, like, I, I like to eat and stuff and not have my makeup come off, but whatever. You know, it's a dollar. It's a dollar. But the pigmentation and just, like, the color and just everything like that, like, it's pretty good for a dollar. Like, I'm, I'm not saying, like, you can't go, I mean, you can't go wrong with it, you know? So it's pretty good. So $2. For, I mean a dollar. That's number two. It's not the number, number two. Is that backwards? Number two. Mm-hmm. And then I think this lasts two years too. Yeah. This one's number one. I'm going backwards. Okay. Number one. Oh my god. This is like super pink. I thought it was going to be like a... Like a more to nude I don't know like it's really hard when you order online you just don't know okay so this is a pink or really pink color and I'm gonna oh I forgot to smell these it smells the same uh that's a nice chunk yum Gross. And it still like came out like that. Whoa, this is super pigmented. But a little chunky. I'm not liking this though. Maybe I have to like shake it up or something. But I don't know what I'd wear this like. You know what? I'll probably just do like an ombre effect. That's what I'll do. So yeah. I mean, it was kind of chunky, but I you know what I'm going to do. Oh, that's number five. Let me, let me get an order here. Okay, this is number three. It's more like a like a bright hot pink. This is hot pink. Honestly, I don't even know my pinks anymore. Or this is like magenta. I don't know. You tell me. It's 
find. I'm hoping it. Oh, hello. Okay, yeah, definitely a hot pink. Probably like Barbie pink. This one's more like magenta because it's a little darker. Okay. So, geez, I don't know what color. I'm probably going to do like an ombre effect or something because the, just, I don't know if I'd wear this. Whoa, I definitely have to shake this one up. It was kind of watery. I have to shake this one up. Really watery. I don't like that. I don't it's like. Okay. I'm like really watery. Uh, no. I don't like this. You can tell it's like not as pigmented as the others. Like off the bat. Like do I have to put like another coat so it can look like that? And it's chunky. Mm, gross. I don't know. It's like hit or miss. You know what I mean? I swear like I feel like all other YouTubers like rave about this. And I'm just like kind of disappointed a little bit. I mean I'm not saying like oh look. See? Like it comes off. But um. I'm not saying don't go buy it, like it's like it's a good price for what they give you, you know, so what are you gonna do? I'm still gonna wear them. I'm just not gonna eat anything or drink anything. So like I said, I'm not trying to give them a bad rep. I'm just telling you what I feel like. But like I said, I love Shop Miss A. I'm telling you, there's some good stuff in here. There's some still good stuff, I'm gonna tell you. But you know, like we just gotta, we gotta look. So this is number five. I don't know what color this is kind of like fuchsia, maybe. I'm not sure. Oh, here comes another chunk. Right off the bat, I'm gonna shake it up a little bit though. Okay. Next up, I have another chunk. Ooh, I like this color. And it's pigmented. Yes, I like this. For sure. This one's one of my favorites. I love this color. Yeah. I would say this one and this one's my favorite color. And then these two I'm just kinda like mad. Yeah. Okay, so I got this one. And it's in I think number six, I think. But the thing about this one though is what I wore today. Like it's a pretty color, love it. The only thing is that the wear. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna go get the one that I already opened. BRB. So this one. Meep. And I Okay. So like I said, I like this color. Note Shabe. I feel like it's the same as the other colors to be honest with you. It looks like the rose wine color from Clean Colors. I'm, I'm telling you, this one's my favorite. I'm gonna wear this one around I am. Oop. Tell you it comes off quick. I mean I guess you just have to like let it dry. So this one's been like two minutes already, so I'm just gonna rub it down. See? Rub it down. Lightly rub it, Meep. So, like I said, you're just gonna have to pat it down with the tissue or something. All right, so on to the next. Gee, but they're hard to take off on here though. Okay. So what else I got for lip stuff? I got lip scrubs, so I'm really excited. About that. Um, this is. Sugar lip scrub, all natural lip scrub. Okay, so I've seen this at Target. No, not Target. Scratch that. Ross. I've seen it at Ross. And you get the whole, like, seven of them, like, the whole package. And it has, like, watermelon, mango, like, you name it. Like, all the flavors on there. And it's, like, $7, $7.99, $6.99. I'm not sure. But, um, they're each a dollar. So, I mean, I'm, I would, I don't know. I haven't tried this yet. So, like, if I go to Ross, I'll buy the whole set. So, because I don't like waiting. And... I'm saying this takes too long. Oh, oh God, it smells so good. Okay, definitely smells like raspberries. But the product in here seems like it's half of it. Like, 
Like I could hear, I don't know if you could hear. Like I could hear air. I don't know where you could hear that from. Like, just air. Oh, here we go. It's popping in a little bit. Pop. So. Ooh. You can tell it has sugar in it. Tastes kind of good. I don't know if it's edible. That's cool. Exfoliates. Um, yeah. Exfoliante Lipal. It's for a year. Made in Taiwan. Well, I just don't like it that it's like, like half the product is. But we'll see. If I really, really like it, then I'll go buy the seven ones. Okay, so this one. I think it's from the same brand. Oh yeah, so it's Beauty Treats. And I got this one in Vanilla Bean. I love Vanilla Bean. I like eat Vanilla Bean ice cream. Just love everything about Vanilla Bean. And um, it's a lip scrub. I don't know, like, I like applying it with the applicator of like this part, like the little, little thingy on there. So I'll probably just like scoop some out or something or like grab my finger, put it on there and just rub it in there. So I'll probably do that. But, um, I just want to smell it because I love vanilla bean. Vanilla bean. Love it. Come on, come on, come on. Get the radio. I don't even know how that song goes, but I don't remember. Come on, come on, get the radio. I don't know if that's how it goes. Come on. I just want to open this. Like, why don't you let me open up my vanilla bean? Uh, okay, it's open. Doesn't smell like anything. Doesn't smell like anything. Really? I'm a scorey bit. It doesn't smell like anything. I'm really disappointed. I mean, it has a little. So, this is what it looks like. It has little. little. um. sugar things or whatever. But it doesn't smell like. no at all. We're really sad. Really sad. Now my hands are sticky. And this will look like without me doing it, and it doesn't smell like anything. It doesn't smell like anything. Disappointed. Really disappointed. But I'll still use it as lip scrub, but it doesn't smell like vanilla bean. Really sad. Okay, moving on. So, um, I'm really excited to announce that I bought hold on I like stocked up okay these wonder blenders beauty blenders whatever you call it is a dupe for the beauty blender the original beauty blender okay so I like four of them Four of them. Yeah, four plus five right here. This is the one I've been using, and let me tell you, it's better than a brush on your face. Like, I used to use brushes all the time for my face, and then I was like, no, like, it wastes a lot of product, and it was, like, really streaky, and it was just gross, and then I just started using the, this beauty blender, and I didn't want to purchase, because I had a beauty blender, like, and then, you know, I had to throw it away, whatever, so... I went back to brushes and then afterwards I was like no like I want to be beauty blender again so I was like I tried this one for a dollar hello and um it's the best like you just can't go wrong so I just stocked up on these and it's just great like I like I don't know how to tell you like I just went crazy like cuckoo nuts for this like I don't know like I'm in love so this just works so much good you just blend it I mean 
Um, you just damp it and then, you know, whatever. But the thing is about washing these, though, like, it takes me, like, a good five minutes, like, to squeeze everything out, squeeze everything out, and stuff like that. And then soap gets trapped in there, and then you squeeze everything out, and it's just, like, merp. But, you know, whatever, like, it's better than a beauty brush, so, for me, I think, personally. So, let me show you the difference, like, damp and not damp. So, this is not damp, so it's dry, and this is wet, or damp, so you can tell the difference. And I'm telling you, like, they're called Wonder Blunders, but they're just, they're just the best, they're the best. So I got them in three shades, pink, three of them in pink, one black, and one pearl. So I got that, and, yeah. And I also got these brushes. So I know I have so many brushes, like, you don't even understand. But they were a dollar, and you can't go wrong with them. So I know the next time I go back on there and, like, get um, brushes, they're gonna be the eye brushes, because I need more blending brushes. But these, like, you just can't go wrong for a dollar, and they're just so soft. Just, oh my god, like, soft. Oh, my god, my face. Huh, yes. So soft. And I just got these three. Oh, and by the way, if you purchase more than one, like single brushes, like if you buy the package, I feel like you should buy the package. Like the whole ten for ten dollars instead of just singles. But I bought like two singles or like two singles, two single brushes in one order. And I didn't read the line or whatever, and it says if you purchase one or two. No. If you purchase more than one brush it'll take you longer to pack get your it'll take you longer to package like or to ship or something like that and i was like why but whatever just yeah so i'll just say just get the 10 like, seriously like they're so worth it they're they're so soft like just i mean i don't i don't know what to tell you like you just have to get it yourself like they're just so soft they're just they're just freaking soft this is so fun. And yeah, so I got these just to, for like my highlight or uh, and like bronzing highlights and stuff like that and blush out. So, yeah. so I got that. And I also got like another thing too to like clean brushes, which is a genius by the way. Like, it's called um, a brush cleaning egg. And this has been really popular lately. But um, I was expecting it to be bigger, but it's not. But it's okay. You know, it's cute, I'll put my fingers, and you just, you know, brush it on, let me get my brush. And you just, you know, just go on by else, and you just rub it off. And yeah, you just beep, 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 beep. And I don't know, it has like, stripes right here, and then it has like a little, like little dots for, I think, honestly, like, you like wash this first, and then you go in here, I'm not sure, or go like this, and then go like that, I don't know. I'd have to look up a video or I'd have to show you myself and see which works best. And I clean it with dish soap and um, and olive oil. So the dish soap really gets all the grease and stuff out of there. Like I saw a commercial like, what is it called? It's like downy? I don't know, whatever. So like a, the dish soap for washing dishes, it gets all the grease out. And olive oil like gets all the grease out too. But it moisturizes your brushes so they can be soft. Sorry if I'm looking here and then I'm looking here. I'm just, just trying to get used to this whole thing. So, okay, anyway, so after the face, so we don't have any more face stuff, but on top, actually I do. I have eyelashes. Oh, I forgot. So I got these ones and I just got like a more natural looking ones. Like, oh, look at all. More natural looking ones. And yeah, so try these on and make sure what they look like. But, okay, so. After that, oh, I got some more stuff too. I got like facial masks. Oh, cool. And I didn't know this one. Okay, I don't, I've never put these on before. And this one's like a creamy texture. Like, it's not a skin mask. Like, it's not a mask at all that you just put on your face immediately. Like, you gotta, you gotta rub it in. And then it dries off. So that's new. And this one, um,. I think it's an actual mask because I feel the mask in here. Yeah, and this one I got is strawberry. I was gonna get pomegranate, but and then oh, and then when I got the brushes, it like tells you like what they're for and stuff like that. So like I said, just get all ten of them and they're just ten dollars. 
Okay, next on, um, I got, okay, so I got cards. Okay. This is the first time, like, you know, winter, fall is coming, you know, fall, winter. And I love cards. I have a freaking collection of them. So I was like, oh, like, whatever, like, I'll check them out. It's only a dollar. And, like, I honestly don't pay more than, like, five dollars for a scarf. Like, on during the summer at Charlotte Russe, like, there's this one time they were like three dollars and I snatched up like ten of them and yeah because they want like one scarf for like ten bucks I was like mm, no like I'm telling you like I'm cheap but I buy like good quality stuff like I don't know how to it. like even if I had money like you know I got paid or something and or I have like a like a lot of my savings and like I could buy stuff but like I just don't you know what I mean like I like saving my money and also like like it's just unnecessary sometimes when you have to pay for so much for just one thing you know but anyway, so this is this part. Ooh, it feels soft. Okay. So this one's in like like watercolor kind of thing. This is on the description. And it has like a bunch of colors that are orange, your nice blue, and it looks like watercolors for sure. And it's like this color. This is the like buns. It's like really long actually. So let me just try to make it out. It's like I'm gonna be a freaking blanket. Anyway, so let's see here. I like going on. Okay, hold on. Oh. Come on, man. Cute. It has like a. I don't know. It's like like if you wear it with a plain shirt, you know, plain shirt, jeans, and like a cardigan. I think it look really cute. Like it's just watercolory and just I don't know. It just says the same thing. You know, I don't know. It's like really artsy. But it's really it's really pretty. Like you know, it just has like different colors of champagne. It has like, flowers on it. It's just like it's, it's cool. I don't know. I don't feel bad. I mean, I don't hate it. You know, but I don't know. okay. So the next one I got I was kind of disappointed because online it had pink stripes instead of. Uh, orange and blue stripes in it. And when I got it online, I thought it, like, I'll probably like put a post picture up. It looked like fruit berry, like fruit berry, fruit berry, something like that. Like, right? Like, a, like really nice brand. And I was like, ooh, the pink little thing reminds me of that really fancy brand. And, um, yeah. So, I mean, I love like how it came in. So, like, put it on top and just really cute. Like, I, I'm not saying I don't like it, but I'm just saying it's disappointing because. I thought it was a pink color and online looked like a pink color. So like I said, I'll show you the, the picture. So this one actually goes down. I don't know what the other one. Oh. Hold on. So this one looks like... Like, this one's cuter, right? So, yeah, I mean, like, you can't go, oh god, wrong for a dollar. I'm not super mad, but just a little disappointed, okay? So that's what it looks like. Yeah. So I'm ready for winter. I can't imagine like the look color. Bum. Okay, so my boyfriend has been like bothering me about getting socks. He's like, baby, you don't have any socks. Blah blah blah. I was like, all your socks have holes in them. Just true. But I was like, I'm not gonna pay uh, like ten dollars for a freaking pair of socks or five dollars for a pair of socks. And I don't even wear shoes a lot because I like to wear sandals and I live in Arizona, so it's freaking hot and I'm not gonna wear ten shoes. But now that winter's coming need some socks. So, I got some socks. Bang. And they're dollar each. And they're really cool because they're just like, you know, like no one's going to see anything. Just, uh, yeah, they come with three pairs. And I got these ones. And this one says sport on them. So yeah, for a dollar. And they come, honestly, like they're black, but they have like color on them. And they come... They tell you the sizes, like, like for girls, so it's like 5 to 8 or 5 to 9, and this one's 9 to 11, but I'm usually a, an 8, so, or like 8 and a half, so that's why I just got the 9 ones, because I feel like they'll fit bigger, because 5 to five to 8 is like, I'm pretty sure it's a lot smaller, and they probably will shrink, so I just didn't get those, so I got the bigger sizes, yeah, so 9 to 11 sizes, so yeah, so I got that for a dollar, so 2 bucks, um, for the pants and I was just like cool like I don't need to go buy socks so y'all yeah. um I hate that I'm looking here and then I'm not looking there what else did I get oh yeah so for toes and stuff and I got oh toes huh I got nail polishes and um these nail polishes which I will open right now they're clean color like I have a bunch of those nail polish too from shop shop Muse in clean color but oh this is cool but um that was like from like two years ago like I bought from from this 
online store before, but it was like two years ago and I bought jewelry and nail polish, so I didn't buy makeup. So I got the 45 second top coat, and I don't know, I just didn't like any of their, um, what's them call it, their uh, nail polishes on, on site, and most of them, the cool ones were sold out. This one's Madly Matte, and I already have these ones actually, I bought them in a set at Ross for like seven bucks. And um, they come with one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six of them, but I got them for seven bucks. I think it was like six ninety nine. But either way, it's like a dollar each, you know, but plus tax. And um, but yeah, like they come with. Let me show you. These are the ones you can find these online too on Shop Mize. But I bought these um, at the store, and it comes with a base coat. So there's base coat. This is for garlic to for nail growth. This one is um, the top coat as well, high shine, but it doesn't, it's not like 45 seconds or anything. And this one's for calcium, a nail straightener. And I, a uh, strength, strength, strengthener, not straightener. And um, I cut, I had, used to have fake nails on, and then um, I cut them, so I was trying to make them grow and stuff. But um, the package, those four also come with the 45 second one and the Madly Matte. So I bought, you know, these two extra ones and uh, the Madly Matte. And, I mean, you can't go wrong with, like, I don't want to do the whole DIY cornstarch thing. Like, you use cornstarch to make your nails matte. So I was like, that's just too much. So I'll just buy this for a dollar. So, yeah. And also, I got these nail polish removers from LA Colors. And it smells like Grey Kool-Aid. I just want to like lick it, but I can't because I know it tastes gross. But it smells like grape Kool-Aid, and let me tell you, it doesn't work. I don't know. I was disappointed. Well, let me demonstrate it for you. Like, <laughs> yeah, let me demonstrate. So it says like 32 sheets, and look, look how thin the sheet is. Like you could, like it's just so thin. And or like you could grab two sheets, like you know, I'm pretty sure you can and put them together and I just I like to fold them so they have extra and look I'm gonna show you I'm gonna scrub really hard scrub so hard I'm scrubbing and nothing yeah and you wanna see my nail? it looks the same they just smell good so I was just like, that sucks. So I'm just gonna use the containers or something, and I bought two of them, and I was gonna go, I was gonna go crazy, I was gonna buy the pear one, I was gonna buy the apple one, or whatever colors that they, or scents that they had. Um, but I was just like, no, I'll just get two and see how it works, and it was just really disappointing. So I wouldn't get them if I were you, I would never repurchase them. And also I got, um, like just toe separators. My mom likes me to paint her toes a lot, so I'm just like, girl, let me separate those toes. <laughs> and so I got that, and oh, and I also got washi tape, I think that's what it's called, right? Washi tape? Washi tape, stationary sticker, lace, and I got, um, and this, it's like, it looks like a bow. I don't know if you can tell, but it's actually a bow. It doesn't look like, oh, it goes like this. It's a bow. And I got this purple one. I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a rose. Mm, yeah. So I got that. And that's pretty much it. So thanks, guys, for watching. Subscribe if you'd like. But I know y'all are going to come see me again. So, you know, it's going to pop up in your news feed sometime sooner or later. So, um, but yeah. So subscribe. And thank you for watching. And like if you liked it. And um, I'll come out with some more videos. And I'll definitely... Um, get the whole full makeup look with just shop masse stuff i didn't get any foundation or anything because they were all sold out for the colors that i wanted but i mean i'll try to do with the stuff i already have and maybe i'll do just like a lip wear kind of thing like i'll wear the lipstick for like throughout the whole day so you know what i'm talking about and i'll record it like it's just it looks gross like uh, my boyfriend was just like i don't want to kiss you don't look appetizing i'm like okay cool so yeah, so thanks for watching guys, and um, I'll have some more videos coming up. Actually, I just bought this like charcoal face, like, uh, like charcoal face, um, what's it called? Like, this looks like latex, and then you just wipe it off, or not wipe it off, you like peel it off, and it's from China, so I'm gonna do a 
video on that. So stay tuned. So thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. Okay, bye. <laughs> bye.